Yes, started. By the way, welcome back to SA Live, everyone. And oh, the excitement is building, and Jen Tobiastrowski is still out there. That's right. And Jen, we hear there's free stuff to do out there, right? That's right. We've made our way to the Freeman Coliseum and with your grounds ticket, right? That includes watching all the different competitions. Now behind me, you'll see that they are doing the cutting. They're not currently doing it right now, but if you're familiar with the Yellowstone episode where they have the horses and they cut and they show all that they do there, that's we have judges here and it's really cool to get up close and see what they do, especially tying it to that popular series Yellowstone. But this is just one of many different competitions, including the bullfighters only, where you can get up close with that and see that, that's amazing. The youth rodeo, uh, also busting in the barn, the cute kids, we talk about that. The Escaramusa competition, which is the only female equestrian event here. And then along with the carnival, now there's what, 44 different committees here on the rodeo. So there's a lot of people involved in making sure this all comes together nicely. Everything from the food to the beer um, and, and everything in between. And behind us, you even have the Abilene Zoo is back out here. So you can even get up close with some wildlife as well. So if you are looking to plan your trip out here, we do have a map for you to look at the grounds. And that way, it's a good idea to look at that ahead of time because you can plan where you're going. We mentioned the carnival, that's always a hit with the kids. And also to get your parking ticket because that's something you can get ahead of time just by heading to the website. And that definitely saves some time, some and, and allows you to plan your trip accordingly. And we have Sage here with us. Hello, Sage. Hi. Hi. So can you tell us a little bit about what's going on behind us? Sure. So today we have our cutting horse show going on. And so we have riders from all over the place that have come with their horses to come compete here for big prize money. This is really neat. I know that we we connect it to Yellowstone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how difficult would you say this is? I would say it's very difficult. It takes a lot of time, a lot of effort, many years of training for both horse and rider. So definitely very difficult. And this is one of many different competitions and events. Can you also uh, name a few of the others that people can come and watch? Absolutely. So inside of the Freeman Coliseum, we will be having many events. We have about 15 events going on over the next 18 days. And we will have everything from barrel racing to team pinning. We have a big youth rodeo that we put on, sheepdog trials. So you can find a little bit of everything in here. What's your favorite? <laughs> Well, I don't know that I can totally pick a favorite, but I am partial to our youth rodeo where we see some of our youngest rodeo athletes coming out and uh, we, we know we'll see them competing in the at and Center someday. Yeah, and this is a lot of work that they put into this, right? Yes, definitely. And, and all for a good cause. It is all for a good cause. It's, it's so many volunteers that come out and you know, they put their heart and soul and many, many hours, blood, sweat, and tears into what they do to pull this off. Yes, I, next year is the, what, 75th anniversary? It sure is, yes, So yes. a big milestone um, and a lot of fun to be had out here. Thank you so much, yes. Sage. Again, don't forget, you can go to the website to get everything you need to come out here and enjoy. Don't forget about the food too, because that's my favorite oh, yeah. part. Uh, but again, you can come and enjoy and a lot of hard work that goes into all of this. Fiona, Mike, you plan to come out again? That's so fun to see out there. Thank you very much. Of course Jen. we are. Have a lot of yeah. Of course. Go hit the Ferris wheel mm -hmm. now. On